your stock at one point, I think, went to $100, but then it went down to 6 or something like that. At the peak of the internet bubble, our stock peaked somewhere around $113. Okay. And then after the internet bubble uh, you know, busted open, our stock went down to 6. It went from 113 to 6 in less than a year. So My annual shareholder that year starts with a one-word sentence, and that one-word sentence is the word, ouch. So most of those internet companies of the dot-com era are out of business. Yeah. You survived. What was it that made you to survive and virtually the rest of them are gone? Um, I, it was very, that whole period is very interesting because the stock is not the company and the company is not the stock. And so as I watched the stock fall from 113 to 6, I was also watching all of our internal business metrics, number of customers, profit per unit, um, uh, you know, uh, everything you can imagine, defects, et cetera. Every single thing about the business was getting better and fast. And so as the stock price was going the wrong way, everything inside the company was going the right way. And um, uh, I, you know, so I wasn't, we didn't need to go back to the capital markets. We didn't need more money. The only reason, uh, you know, a financial uh, bust like the internet bubble bursting is, you know, makes it really hard to raise money but you know, we already had the money we needed, so we just needed to continue to progress.